All right, hey everybody, quick video about this shelf. I got it in 96 from a rental store, Video Max, in Newton, Kansas. They were bought by Blockbuster. They didn't go out of business because of rental stores not being a thing. Um, it's a Nintendo branded shelf. It's got Nintendo everywhere on it. The seal up here on the topper. This is uh, indented in. Um, very few scratches on most of the places here um there are a couple like whatever that is i don't know if that's a scratch they repainted that's about the most egregious one um but here you can see walmart on that side but i guess the rental store didn't want to say walmart so it looks like they have a sticker of games for sale over there uh, i left it untouched um look like there's a little scrape there but that i'm pretty sure is what the rental store added because i don't know if nintendo would have budget and special value video games they would probably have nintendo games um who knows maybe this is something uh, one if anybody knows anything about this please let me know i've only seen this one and uh two i may be selling this out of hutchinson kansas i just want to do a quick video showing what it is uh, it has roller wheels they can be locked you see the orange uh, ends on this side and needs to clean up okay they're just dusty it's been in a basement a finished basement no leaks or nothing no dirt floors and these don't have those orange things i don't know why um i didn't mention it nintendo's on every single shelf except for the white four shelves there are 16 shelves total um i left this open so you can kind of see where the shelves click in so you can have as many or as little as you want in the positions you want um Here's the, the one thing that's kind of odd. Uh, this seal does not seem to stick after 20 some years on some of these. And I took it out, uh, it's on the ground there from, from that part. But here, and that's not broken or anything, that's how it actually looks. Um, you can still see it in there. And this still fits in there. But a couple need to be resealed. And I've done that before, um, back in 2002 or so. It's not too hard, and nothing left any damage, as you can see, whatever they used before. Um, you know, it's pretty tough plastic. Just a miracle no uh, broken pieces or missing pieces <laughs> are on this thing. Um, even being in a rental store in Walmart, <laughs> going through that and not having anything happen, I think, is pretty good. Um, lastly, I'll just show you this separate shelf. It's uh, plastic shelves, as I mentioned. And they kind of have this metal connector piece that goes by two screws. They're all pretty much like that. Um, on the whites, it's got two of the two shelf uh, ones and two of the just the one shelf ones, if you can see. And the only thing missing is um, just a couple normal screws where this topper screws in. I don't know if you can see it or not. It's probably dusty in there, so sorry. And the only other thing is this uh, base. There they are. You see those holes? Those are for um, those, what are those called? Hex bolts or whatever. The, I don't know, the stupid, <laughs> whatever they're called. Um, but somehow those got lost in the move, but it sets on there. It's actually, it pulls like that where you can see those. Um, with those in there, it would be locked in place, but now I could pull it up. You know, if I had all the shelves off and did it safely, of course. Um, but that would just be something to be aware of. Just missing a couple of those bolts, hex bolts, or I can all think of the name as soon as the video stops. But uh, they had the uh, the little triangle wrenches uh, to, to screw them. I don't know the exact size um, that they're called, but I'm sure they're pretty common. As are the, the couple missing screws. So that's just setting on there. But you could even put, you know, nails in that hole just so it, you know, wouldn't uh, fall off the side if it gets moved. But that's the only thing missing, fortunately. Um, a couple of bolts and a couple of screws. Other than that, it's a great piece for how old it is. Uh, thanks for letting me know what you know about it or if you've seen any similar. I mean, I've even searched Google Pictures and I haven't seen much about it. So again, uh, hopefully I covered everything. Again, it, it moves, it has wheels, they lock in place. The shelves are all removable and adjustable. And it breaks down pretty easily. I just don't have the room to get it back to Ohio. So uh, it might be setting here in Kansas another year. Unless uh, 
I do something with it quicker than that. But thanks for looking. I um, hope you like this cool old piece. Have a good day.